what the heck is going on guys today we are back with another bbg series today is the yellow jacket fight we're going to be doing both missions the easier mission and the harder mission um and for magic we are going to do the lure on her for both <clears throat> for all the other characters we're going to skip through but as far as watching the cutscenes and stuff like that um that's going to be for this video uh so i just no investment into my magic i just have the outfit that you can buy um for her for from new stark city which is actually like her best costume she's one of the lucky ones so this is awesome an early investment and this is something we will keep on her till end game so i if you watch any of the other videos i've explained to you how a couple of these characters i only bought it just to get me through the beginning of the game um luckily for magic this is going to be good for her throughout every mission all the way up so let's do it <clears throat> Hank Pym switching sides. My cell on the rafts during that mess with the outriders, after all, because my bio signature gave him unlimited access to your little toys. Oh, Hank Pym, why? Oh, a long time ago, I was Hank Pym, but that part of me is dead. Now you can call me Yellow Jacket. All right. Let's go. You betrayer. I don't know how you could do this to us. Magic is honestly a beast. Like I on my main account, I she's not the greatest for PVP, but she is really good in Omega Wars. And she's really good for all the PvE content. The only spot she really struggles is um, Dimensional Duel. I don't think she's very strong in it. But overall, she's actually a very well-rounded character um, from playing her um, on my main and on here. Now, obviously, I've never like actually played her, played her, or have good gear for her. So, I mean, it's hard for me to say, but I do really like her as a base champ. So we're going to save that ulti for a little bit till we need it. I'm going to try to be a bit more aggressive knowing I have that ulti. So our health got a little low there, but it's still okay. And then if we get to the point where our ult's full below before we drop too, too low, then... Oops. Like right there, so I made a mistake there, so now my ulti can save me. Ooh, I got guard broke. Hopefully I'm good enough here. Yeah, we're good. So even with the baddest, worst thing happening and misplaying like crazy, because we saved that ult, we're still in good shape. We do need to back off a bit here, though. We gotta get some health back. <clears throat> He's got his little bees up, so we're gonna have to kill those at some point. So you see we can attack these little swarms here, so we want to do that. Just trying to get back a bit of health here. I was a little too aggro with my alt there. But we almost got our health all back up and where it should be. As you guys can see, whenever we see that yellow, we run, we don't want to get caught by any anything that has a red um, <clears throat> a red animation to warn you about it and gives you the yellow on your dash. You got to make sure you miss those. Those are going to do big damage to you. So we almost have our Volstag up. We almost have our alt up, so we'll be able to get back some of this HP here. There's Volstag. Oh, 
Oops. So we're going to pop our ult. So as you can see, we did take a lot of damage there because we got hit by um, one of those red abilities. Guard break, but we have the dashes to get out of it, which is awesome. Um, so I opted not to use enhancers um, because I figured I'd be fine. Um, if you do find you're struggling, uh, don't be afraid to use enhancers. They are craftable, so it is a little bit of waste of resources, but it's less wasting of resources than um, opening costumes and things like that and stuff on characters you're not sure you're going to play um, as your main. So we almost got him down here. We're going to be pretty aggro. We have to avoid those. Nothing we can really do about that. All right, there we go. So he's down once. Let's see what he has to say. No, I spent years rotting in that cell on the rafts. Ugh. I won't go back. Never. Oof! He got away from us. Yeah, Tony. Why didn't he realize sooner, bruh? Hank was the real target all along. Oh no. And there's another version of him out there that will be a bigger problem. All right. Let's go back to headquarters and find him. Okay, I'm gonna put it on auto just to get through this stuff. <coughs> Introduction to most wanted. So, how come you just stand in here? It's a miracle anything ever gets done around here with rookies like these. Ah, finally, someone who can make things happen. Come on, we got a lot of work to do. And by we, I mean you. Well, that's the first time I've ever actually watched that cutscene, so. Fun. Alright. Let's go find this Monsieur Yellow Jacket. Where are you at, Mr. Yellow Jacket? Oh, oops, sorry guys. Oh, 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 I screwed up. It's fine, it's fine. My bad, I apologize, guys. Here we go. Let's do this. So hopefully we're good. We're 10k below. I don't have potions, but I'm not too worried. Oh! Alright, so my team's in here. We're trying to... Find the yellow jacket. I promise I'll try not to cut cutscenes. I'm not really um, a lure person usually, but I can appreciate the story when I actually do watch it. Um, and this one was very well done, actually, from what I've seen. Some There's some issues with some of the characters. They're a little worse than others, but um, overall, the cutscenes and everything in the storyline is, is very well done, so... Make sure we actually, let's get some of this while we have the chance. Make sure we're Gucci. So in my opinion, every single boss is beatable no matter what your power is. Because if you go one shot, you get one shot, right? So learning to dodge the abilities that one shot you and to know the animations for them and to know when they're coming is how you're going to get through this. So I'm hoping as the bosses get harder and harder, I'm going to be able to show you guys how to do this. Also, don't be afraid to take advantage of um, enhancers and your revives. Um, they are cheap in comparison to actually building your character up strong enough to do the content, um, like to do the bosses, and then you just go slow through the world. It doesn't matter how many times you die in the world or how long it takes if you get through. 
Now, if you're on your main, that's a different story. Maybe you want to look at trying to get stronger and, and things like that. Um, but you don't want to decide your main too early either, right? You have to even decide maybe what content in the game you like. Like, maybe you want to be PvE, maybe you want to be PvP. A lot of people know themselves, I guess, but... So, so far this mission has been pretty easy, just killing his little minions to get to him. What the hell? Well, I was hoping to not have to use our alts here, but it's almost capped, so I'm not going to waste it. Plus, we have a mini yellow jacket here to kill that we don't seem to be doing any damage to at all, which is kind of weird. Yeah, he's just like healing. I don't know what's happening here. So this is interesting. There we go, we got guard break on him. He's still just not taking any damage. I don't understand what's happening. Why is he not taking any damage? What the fuck is going on, guys? Seriously. Um, okay, I guess I'm relogging. Like, sorry to ruin the video, guys. Like, that's that was pretty crazy. I have no clue what happened there. That's there's no way that's how that's supposed to be. So let's just relog. Um, I don't know what to say. Um, I can't really restart the video because that's the second mission. Um, so I'm gonna be honest. This sucks. Sorry. Um, nothing I can really do about it. There. That was ridiculous. There's no way that's how that mission's supposed to be. He just has infinite health? I don't think so. So, let's see. For some reason, honestly, my game bugs out, like, a lot on bosses. Like, a lot. I, <coughs> I haven't heard from very many people this problem, but, like, even yesterday, I was on my main doing Corrupted Sorceress Supreme, which is a super hard mission in Dark Domain. And I beat it like 10 times and it just wouldn't acknowledge that I beat it. He just kept reviving over and over. Like what just happened right here. That guy just wouldn't die. I, I don't know. Now in the Corrupted Sorcerer Supreme, you do have to kill a bunch of guys super quickly. And if you don't kill them quickly enough, he revives. So like it makes sense, but... I don't know, let's hope this works. It was pretty frustrating, not gonna lie. I do think on that um, wave that I was on there, I think he like splits a bunch of times and like keeps switching into um, bees and things like that. So I think that that might have been the issue, but we'll see. All right, let's see.
If anyone knows any free editing services, let a girl know because I need an editing service. Alright, let's see. This is the part, right? Okay, okay, so that he turned on Hank Pym. So we'll try to kill all these guys and then we'll fight that. We're still just not doing any damage to him again though, I can already see it. Let me dash. Oh, I didn't have one. Okay. Um, yeah, so here we go. We're just on him again. I don't know. It doesn't look like we can do enough damage. Some things... Yeah, guys, I, I, I'm at a loss here. I don't know, we're just too weak? I don't know, this, this didn't happen to me before, so... My first time trying to do this mission, I guess, but like, this didn't happen to me on my main. This is crazy, I don't know what's going on. Why we can't kill him. What is the secret? Do we straight up just not hit hard enough? Is that what's going on? There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. So see how he did start to split up though and there's like bees and stuff, so I don't know. Um, either A, it bugged, B, you have to bring him up, up here into this little platform, one or the other, or hey, maybe we just weren't doing enough damage, I don't know, either way, that was super strange, the good news is, we beat him, so again, couple strategies there if you're struggling, potentially you need more damage, that could have been what was going on, potentially you need to bring him, so you guys see how this map here, we started fighting him right in here, potentially you need to bring him up onto this ledge, um, so a few different options there. But let's get into it. So there's still more. Okay, I'm going to turn on auto for a second here. Cause... Alright. Oh, we're fighting again? Okay. Yeah, so again, I don't really, I'm not really 100% sure there. Like I said, I've had issues where... Um, I know for sure it bugged out. Um, there I might have just been a little bit impatient. Um, or we needed to bring him up here, so. This is my first time through this mission with all the characters, so usually the lure video is, um, the least informative one, because I'm going through it for the first time with you guys. I usually do the lure on Storm, but... Okay, who am I even fighting? Alright, camera angle screwed me up a bit here. Let's go into two. Nice. So, fairly easy other than that one part. Even though, even if we couldn't do health on him, though, it was actually relatively easy. He didn't do very much damage to us. Magic is pretty tanky, so. Ooh, we have Kingpin and Ultron. Okay, let's go. <coughs> So this wasn't the big yellow jacket stage. This is Kingpin and Ultron. All right, all right, all right. P. 
him was just the distraction. Oh no. cutscenes man some of them they just didn't do a good job the story is good but they they screwed up the volume and things like that all right so we're fighting two bosses here so we're gonna need to be very careful and keep an eye on both now there's a couple different strategies here you can take down one um, and then deal with the other one which is what I tend to lean towards I try to just keep my eye on the one while focusing on the other, this one just, I happened to choose Ultron for this fight. Um, no particular reason. He was just kind of the first one I was able to target. His um, skills I also find are a tad more deadly. So we got his guard down. As long as we're keeping an eye on Kingpin over there, see how we can see him. Yeah, he's charging. You never want to get caught by one of the other bosses while you're... So again, if you do um, AOE damage to like, you could be trying to group them together a little bit, but that gets a little dangerous because, oof, um, then you're fighting them both off, right? So it seems to be pretty good. It's um, Kingpin's leaving us alone for the most part. He seems to be fighting our, our goons there. I guess you can call them companions. That's not what they are really, but. All right, so there's Ultron down. Let's fight Kingpin. Let's go. Throw this poison down, hopefully pull him into us, guess not. So we missed on that poison a little bit, so that sucked, but... Alright, alright, alright! So we almost got him down too. Break his guard here. Nice. Was able to get that poison damage on there this time. Nice. Easy peasy. Tron. Holy crap. They merged. Let's go. Oof, so that hurt us a lot, so we have to be careful for that one. Ulti up here. Gonna shoot some laser. Oh, okay, big AOE. Shoot. That was a bad time for ulti. I thought he was gonna do lasers on the ground. He's a little bitch. We almost have his guard down. Nice. There we go. So magic, I find um, super easy on these bosses here because that dash is just so long. Like Cap has that too, uh, but Cap obviously isn't uh, quite doesn't do quite as much damage as magic does. Oops. Okay, I let him hit us with a big skill there. So let's take a take a little breather. We almost have an ulti up.
Just avoid his lasers. Gonna let my ulti charge a little bit more. Alright, now seems like a good time for ulti. We got hit pretty hard there. We couldn't quite get out of his ult, so... We almost have his guard down too, so... Nice, there we go. Oh, I thought I was out of that. Okay, yeah, so you have to be really careful. That's like an AoE that he drops on the ground there. Um, it doesn't quite one-shot you, but maybe if you're a little lower power, it might. So it's big AoE. Right here, see it? Yeah. So those hurt you a lot. We almost got him here. There we go. Pim's back. You're no fun, Daredevil. I have a feeling they are foresighting a little bit. Wow! Look at that! Look! Six! Six star costumes, Convergium health. Wow! Awesome! Okay, guys. Well, sorry that one went a little longer. Um, oh, look at that. Butter pack. <laughs> um, okay, but I appreciate you guys so much. As you can see, missions are getting a tad harder. We will keep the information coming. Uh, this was my first round through, so hopefully on all the other characters, it's a bit more informative. Thank you for being here and doing it with me, watching the lure, hanging out. I appreciate you guys so much. Like, comment, subscribe, and we will see you in the next one.